Hello everyone, hope you guys are doing well. Today I'm gonna tell you that uh, how you can remove your Samsung account out of your any Galaxy phone. As I tell, told you before that Samsung account and the Google account are the two, two different things. So the way if you forgot your password for your Samsung account and uh, I'm pretty sure when you're going to try your uh, resetting your account, it's not going to reset your, uh, it's try reset your phone. It's not going to reset your phone because it's going to ask you for the password of your Samsung account. So like if I go and reset factory data reset, factory data reset, I hit reset, it's going to ask me either for the pin or for the, your Samsung account password. So like I I have the sim I have a phone pin so if I am it's asking me for the pin. If I will enter the pin it's going to reset it. But let's suppose if I go back and uh I just remove the pin I don't want to set it up. I just want to clean the pen. It's probably under like a screen lock or something. Yeah, lock screen. So I have set it up three, four things. So I just want to set it up no security, nothing, and see if it's. remove data and everything remove fingerprints here you go so now as you can see there is no password on it and when you go and reset your phone it's going to ask you to enter your samsung account password as you can see that but i don't know that if, if it, the reason i'm making the video most of the people are confused like if they will hard reset this phone at this point and it's going to ask come back on uh, your samsung account to enter the password but that's not true that is true in case of you forgot your google account password and you are not getting in your phone so in that case like if i'm trying to factory data reset and i have my samsung account in it uh, and I'm trying to factory data reset it's asking me to enter the Samsung account password so like you can see when I hit reset is here's my Samsung account mikitatech at gmail.com so now what I can do all I need to do is turn the phone off using the power button this one So it vibrates and that means it's fully turned off. So now you see that this is the Bigsby button and this is the volume up button. Now what you need to do is keep holding the volume up and Bigsby button and turn on your phone. Once you see the logo on the screen, just leave the power button. So then you will be good to go. Here you go, you see this, I turn it on. It's not pressing. Hold on. As you see the logo, leave the power button, but keep holding your volume up button and your Bixby button. So now you are actually in the recovery mod. So at this point, all you need to do is using your volume keys, you can do up and down. You are going to wipe data factory reset press the power button one time to select this option one more time volume down to factory data reset then one more time power button to select and factory data reset so as i reset it 
now I all I need to do press one more time on reboot system now it will reboot and I will set it up in front of you and you will see that it's not asking me for that Samsung account password or anything So while this is booting up, it's going to take like two, three, four, maybe five minutes. So just give it some time. Don't do anything on it. Just hold on. Once it will be turned on, you will be good to go. And one more request I have to please go ahead and subscribe my channel because a lot of people who they are watching my videos but they are not my subscribers please 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 go ahead and subscribe my channel and ring the bell icon so you would know that whenever I am posting my videos so you would get the notification on it as you can see the phone is fully turned on i'm going to set it up in front of you so you would know that uh, it's not asking for any account so just keep that confusion in your mind there's like if there's a google account then it's going to ask you to uh, for the if you have a google account and you forgot the password of that and you hard reset it while you're setting it up, it's going to ask you for that password, but not for the Samsung account. So just keep that in your mind and you're all set and uh, you will soon see that it's going to go on the home screen. See, it's asking you to enter your new or sign in with your Samsung account. when you all finish it up you're all set you're on the home screen so that's it for the day please 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 don't forget to subscribe my channel and uh, i'll be right i will be back with more videos thank you and have a good great day